video so this one is pre-recorded because i do not want the weather to be messing with our schedule i am here with my beautiful baby <laughs> she is so ready for this tutorial her hair feels very very dry and greased too and i will have to start off by moisturizing her hair so i guess you can see everything wow she has really thick and beautiful hair right <laughs> so let's start i also want to edit this video for my mouth time so to moisturize her hair i will be using this it's the mega growth mega growth leave in mega growth daily leave-in straightener just because it softens the hair but i'll not be using too much because i just need just the dryness to reduce that is all so yep that feels slightly better uh -huh feels better it's not feeling like it's going to tear my hand so i'll be using my shine and jam and a rat tail comb but a metal one so let me tell you guys one more thing for the design of this flower see what we are going to do you know the jumping jack the jumping stick man the stick man performing the jumping jack so we are going to have his head his two arms fled open because he's performing the jumping jack and then his two legs while he was mid-air so you have five lines and this is the easiest way i have found to make these sections almost equal just like this so this is what i'll be starting with after this i'll tell you i'll show you what next to do but this is the easiest way to have five equal sections so we're going to do that on this head now can't i look better is there like no um no like filter or something that can make me look more pushed I guess not anyways let's start so on her head i will be putting the flower here here so now i'm going to proceed to make those five lines here so let's start with the front one the headline or the line from his head <laughs> the head of the stick man his head is going to close here let's say this is the line to his head okay this is the line to his head from here to here remember we are braiding a flower today this is the line to his head his left arm or right arm i don't know the angle you can see me from it's either his left or his right arm <laughs> right so Okay. Um when this video will be premiering, I will be live in the chat section in case you have any question, but just know that this video is pre-recorded because last week I missed this live schedule because the weather was bad and today the weather is so good. So I decided to just film. I have this little clip. Very handy. And does not take up a lot of space. So I have one of his hands. Remember we had five, right? So the second one. This whole point is to try and get five equal sections. So if there is any way you can have 
five equal lines in your own way if there's any way that will be more comfortable for you or easier for you then feel free to explore that you're still going to get the same result the whole point is to section a point into five half five um, equal spaces this head i don't know why it's just moving around let me see okay so i'm going to go ahead and pin the second one don't braid it instead of pinning it so that if it is not okay you can very easily i hope this life is scheduled and i'm not actually life life <laughs> because i just saw one person came and left hold on i'm just going to go to youtube real quick and check just to be sure because this video is not for today come on come on come on where am i here you are i'm just going to my channel oh i am live no that was not the intention i wanted to put it on listed what do i do well there's nobody here you can watch this one do i have to start afresh oh my god <sighs> damn oh should i just let it be this is not the right time most of my viewers are not online by this time okay i'm just going to continue but that was not the plan i wanted this to be pre-recorded it's okay we are done <laughs> we are done with these three so remaining two more lines these are going to be the part depicting his legs well, I can already see this side this section is bigger than this section I have to go back and correct that later but for now let's just continue remember remember we are we are making a flower design a flower braid design ah. we are making a flower design a flower braid design oh this was supposed to be pre-recorded, but it's alright. Let me put on the chat, just in case. Okay, so we have our one, two, three, four. The fifth one, the open leg is going to go like this. Then if I feel like they are not equal, you can then go ahead and adjust each section. If one is slightly bigger, it's not going to really ruin everything. But you have to try and come on, come on, come on. Okay. So this section I think is obviously bigger, right? You are the smallest. Hold on. Make a give and belay. Make a give and belay. Let me give this one a little bit more. Is that better? Uh huh. What about you? This one is still so much bigger, right? One, two, three, four, five. Who is the smallest? You. You are the smallest. So to feed you, I have to take in some hair from here. I think for the first time, it's okay if you just do it like roughly. Then when you are sure the lines are okay, then you can go back and make it. So now I am going to take some hairs from here. And let's see. Does that look equal now? One, two, three, four, five. Ah, that's very decent. So I'll be I will continue with this using my shine and jam. If you're just joining me, I'm making a flower braid design. I actually intended to pre-record this video and 
make it go live on Sunday and I mistakenly started the video so I'm just going to let it play today what is today self today is today Thursday or Friday ah. anyways I'm going to go ahead and clean up the lines and try to make them as neat as I can <laughs> did you see the difference the shine and jam does help in making your lines neat it does it helps because as you can see this place is getting so much neater all the strands of hairs are taking formation so everybody knows where they belong uh -huh. if you want to know if you like this mannequin hair and you would like to get it just click on the link my amazon store link in my bio and from there you can see everything i use or closest <laughs> in look or something that looks very similar you can find it there okay so there you go this place is clean should i bother cleaning up all the whole lines with shine and jam it's just going to make me wash this dummy head my it might make my tutorial look better but not so much better than it is already going to look because it is going to look fine my tutorial is going to look fine so this is going to make it look uh maybe 20 percent better uh, come on come on come on okay I am of course just trying to make the sections neat so that you can see very very well everything is going to be clear the tutorial I made of this flower was on my client that has very thick short natural hair so <laughs> When I was replaying that tutorial, I was feeling bad for people that watched it because it would be so difficult to even see, you couldn't even see the sections very well. And during that period, I had not yet started using shine and jam in my salon. It was still coming out newly, it wasn't readily available where I was, so I couldn't have used it to make the sections neater. This one is looking so neat already, so let's just go through it yeah there you go beautiful 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 ah! Ooh -hoo. <laughs> i love my shirt i love my shirt okay yeah done so can you notice any difference between these lines i used shine and jam and the ones i did not use shine and jam this is just make Help you make up your mind on if I am sweating. This is just to make help you make up your mind on if it is worth it or not. You can see the ones I use China and Jama. You can see the one I do not use. It's not as if this is terrible, but this is better. So you have to consider if it is worth it. So let's make a pass your pass, pass, pass. Um you're just going to try to make sure that there is like this a starting point here everybody should know where they are facing just like that that point should be neat as neat as you can all these little details are going to make your design look better than the next one. Oh, cute 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 one more so we have let me also take formation take formation take formation take formation let's get information let's get information there you go i have one more line to clean up this one so i have Hello, can you bend your neck, please? Thank you. Oh, this is so fine. 
okay so i have one more line the last one here then we have our jumping jack man our stick man performing jumping jack as i said that is the hack i used to get any hairstyle i have to share into five sections like flowers or stars i use a stick man that is performing jumping jack exercise as my guide so i have his head his two arms because he's jumping mid air so his two arms are like this and his two legs are like that so it's like straight line two legs open straight line his head two arms open two legs open bam you get your you will get your five sections perfectly that way if you start estimating where you should have your five lines if you are a beginner that might be difficult or more difficult why is this this thing turning around I gave her one quick tight. Hi, so have you left a thumbs up for me? Have you left a thumbs up? Please do. And I appreciate you hanging around. And I hope you get what you're looking for here. Okay, so we are done. Remember our sketch? Remember our sketch, right? Where we had... The jumping jack man, sigma, this is his head, his two hands, and his two legs. Once we are done with this step, the next step is to start making the flower. So I'm going to make sections like this to complete each petal. Make a curve. I think making it robust makes it fat. When I mean robust, instead of making the line look thin and long, make it look fat like this. Did you see the other drawing? Yes. So I'm going to proceed to start doing this now. On each of these five, do this. After this, this is the second step. After this, we have one more step to complete our flower design. Did you just see that? That's the next step. So let's do that. This is so easy, so easy, so easy. Where should we start? Let's start from his headline. So I'm just going to section here like this and like this so i will take off the pin let's see if, if if you're choosing this distance let's say if you're using this distance it should be uniform on all the lines so it should be around here around this distance around this distance that way your flower will be uniform so don't make this one very long and another one short you're going to get okay remember i'm not going to carve it more like this because I want it to be robust so I'm going to go in and fetch a lot of hair right okay so but the beginning part should be a little bit tapered and then you move into the center part and once you get into the bottom part you make it tapered again uh, wait you understand can you Ooh, that's not clear hold on so a little bit tapered robust Wait. okay let's just use this for clarity uh, okay that's better right but you have to make sure you don't take more than half of the quantity of hair between each space of the triangle. Okay, let me use this one and show you. So if you're making petal for this side and this side, don't take more than half when you're sectioning here because you still need to give the same quantity to this line. So in as much as you're making the line robust, don't make it more than half of this quantity it's better if it's smaller if it's smaller you can just push the rest of the hair away but if it's too big you're going to be in trouble so i'm just telling myself that so that i'll make sure that this other hair will be enough for this one so this is just me making 
the petal is that covering of i think it is is it clean enough now i think it is so there are two designs to this right the very first one you can just braid okay this is the easier one let me, maybe let me do this one once you make each of the petal you braid it to the middle each half so for this half and i'm going to curve it i'll try to make my braid curved just because the flower is going to look more curved that way so let's go it's going to be fine as a stitch braid though but in my heart i just want to teach you how to braid the flower don't enter my face do not enter my face there you go this is one of the flowers so this is one petal no this is half of the petal now we are going to complete the second half of the petal from this side oh i can just make the half of this other line so let me make for this petal so i have to consider the distance from here to here to be equal to the distance from here to here so i think it's around here right oh if you're confused give your comb as a measurement so i will just add like a rubber rubber band a colored rubber band here to act act like a ruler so when i place it here i just mark where it stops it's around this bald area so i can start from here and again go in and try to make it look nice come on press it stop falling your head yeah. so for this second one um there you go let me clean it up clean it up again Is it bigger? Hold on, let's see. Um, yeah, maybe slightly. But I'm going to braid it like that. I think it is slightly bigger than this one. Okay, that's the size now. I'm so serious. I'm too serious. So, this is half of another petal. Once you have your five lines, it will be easy to make your petals. So, this is set. I will just start braiding. It is actually very important to make the end to be pointy. Make the end pointed as much as you can. This place is bold. There is just so much I can do, so it's all right. This is good enough. So taking small hair from the beginning, I'm going to braid and carve my braiding. So I don't braid straight. When braiding, I try to make it curve, follow the curve of the outer part of this flower, so that both the braid and the sections look like the flower not just if you if you make it straight it's still going to look like it is supposed to look but the curved one looks more like a flower i guess it does 
I guess it does. How pretty is this? How pretty is this? So, half of one and half of one is complete. Remember, we still have the section, so this is going to contribute to the second half to this petal. I could have turned it for me, they bring life for me now. He don't keep pressing me. Let's go. Remember not to take more than half so that this section can also get something. I'm trying not to take more than half of the bulk of the hair inside the space. Let's see how this looks. Oh. Are we there? So I'm trying to make this place pointy, but of course I'm doing this on a mannequin, not a human being's head. The hair is coming out from wherever it wants to come out. There is no formation on this thing. It was not created by God. So it is not perfectly imperfect. It's just anyhow, anyhow. But this is my favorite mannequin. At least one of my favorite mannequins. If you want to get it, click the link in my bio to my Amazon storefront. And then you're going to see a list I made of all the things a beginner needs. This one is there. Oh, God, make my light. light. Woo! Wahala, wahala. I wish the people watching can talk, eh? Job, Jerry. So, if you just stopped in, I am braiding a flower design, a five petal flower. If you are scared or worried, if you have concerns that you will not get this at once, right? Try the four petals. Four petals is so easy. Instead of making like a jumpy man, when you're starting, you just make like a cross. And then continue from there. So feel free to try that. <coughs> Use four petals. So much easier. Just make a cross on the head. Like four lines. One straight line and another line across that straight line in the middle. Then from there. You can start making this part I am making now very easy and you'll be good. <laughs> so these two uh, one petal. Let's do a one petal. What is one? So I have half and one. Why is this still there itself? It's okay. <coughs> Do not close this line. Oh, make sure your sections use your you use, use your clips to make sure the sections stay different. If you don't want to get frustrated, well, <coughs> I can still see this line. Okay. So now I'm going to section another petal here. 
trying to make sure the distance from here to here is the same distance from here to here so so it's around here <coughs> see if i make this like this it's going to be ugly as like very ugly so remember to make it dainty make it dainty and curvy this is going to be fine you see see the difference <coughs> let's the flower dip this is not even right it's supposed to be okay i guess so i would have liked this side to go in a little bit more but at this point let's see yeah that's nice take formation take formation come not for me to waste my job okay This half is complete, so I'm going to proceed to braid it. Why doesn't it look right? It doesn't look right, does it? I think I came in, can you see, from here to here is bigger than from here to here. <coughs> I went in too much on that other petal. But if I try to compensate for that, it's going to affect this one, so... It's okay. Let's do it like this. And time to braid. If you want to braid and you want the tip of your braid to be pointy, when it's time to make the corn roll, even if you're picking the hair subconsciously, try to pick from like the very beginning start with like the smallest amount of hair you can use to start braiding so that it forms like a needle at the beginning that's the way to make someone should tell this mannequin hair to stop moving her head that is the way to make your braid like needle what those good old days that is plain to pass with this mahala. This section is smaller than that section. I can see that is why I have a problem here. That is why I have a problem here. But this little problem is not going to be an issue. Let's just continue first of all. This mannequin is sweet. It is smaller. Oh. You kids. <coughs> Hope I am not on mute though. Because I cannot tell with this app I just downloaded. I can hear myself. So this is how you guys are seeing me. It's so awkward looking at yourself or listening to yourself, but if you don't get past not caring about that, eh? You'll not be able to do anything in front of people. Chai! I look very, very weird. But that's alright. So this section, this triangle is going to contribute half a petal to this line and half a petal to this line. Easy. So let's start from here. Give me half of this petal to this place. Stop turning your head, though. Ha! Voila. Okay. So let me try and. See, this place is not dainty because I really tried. I don't know. 
You're coming. Coming, coming, coming. you're worried about like if you want this thing to be more perfect then complete your whole sections before you start braiding so that you can go back and look at the lines to be sure you like how the petals look if you if you're someone that likes perfection that's what you can do Nepa, I bring this light now. Does that look fine? Does it look like half of this? They should look like siblings. They might not look like twins, but they should look like siblings. Hold on, let me see it from your view. Wow, you people's view is better than my view, man. I'm stretching my neck. And I think you have to go. You see these tiny hairs, this, this, this ones, this type. Line spoiler. Anyways, I can just leave this one and make this one's own to be sure I like how it looks. So, so they around here. Is this bigger? Hold on, let me screw her, make her head tight again. I don't know why it loses so when I am breathing. Ah, uh, the my eye. Now uh, let's see. So this half and this. Where are you? This one and this one. This one and this one. Oh, I think it's it's good enough. Let me complete it. So now I have an estimate of if the sizes are fair, I can continue. That's what I meant by pre-sectioning. You can just complete the whole sections to be sure you like what you're working with before you continue. So I think I like what I'm working with. So far I can envision the second petal and see where it should be. So I'm going to just braid this one now. Again, trying to get Okay, sure there is no light. Yeah. I'm hearing those people's um, welding something. No, I don't have the same light. Ha, huh. we have the same light though. It's the same transformer that we don't have. If they have light and we don't have something, don't spoil. Okay, time to break. I'm You don't know what is nap and what is light. God bless you. No axe. Not your business. Hey, Sans, blush you, blush you, one petal, second petal complete, and half. Two and half is exactly half of the style. We are halfway through. How many minutes have we been there for? 39 minutes. So let's say one, one hour. One hour just to make flour. That's because I'm explaining too much. Uh. If I were to be making this on a client, like, how this explain, explain. Don't miss if I think I'm slow. <laughs> I know it's so braid fast. Especially when I'm making designs. Hey, you better be pressing your phone and leave me alone to do what I want to do. <clears throat> Apart from that, if it's like box braid, the hair can be fast. But you see these designs, I am going to take my time and have it the way I want it. 
if I make these designs and I don't like the outcome, there's nothing about that hair that is going to look fine to me. And I am going to be frustrated. And if it's because a client was rushing me, next time you come, I am going to dodge you. I will not be the one to make your hair. Because I don't like impatient people. Every day you come to salon, you have to hurry up and go somewhere. Instead of just scheduling a day for your hair, let that day be your hair day, your hair time. And then you go there and just sit down and get your hair braided. Not quick, 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 I get quick, 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 quick. I don't even have anything to do. You want to go home and lie down. Just be shouting everywhere. My apologies, my loves. My apologies. Trying to connect. Are we back? Oh, I apologize. I apologize for the interruption. So are we set here? Oh God, the sweat is entering my eyes. <gasps> Baby, calm down. Yes, I think that's pointed enough. So let's just bridge. The weather is changing again. is pretty. You are pretty, my baby. You are pretty. <laughs> okay. So, the next one here. We are almost done at this point. Almost done. Can you see? We yeah, are almost done. Stop turning your head. You stop turning your head. Stop turning your head. Don't, 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 don't. <sighs> so, as you can see, the next one goes from here to here. Then that will be almost the last line. This is the hey, don't scatter around. Oh, it's alright, stay. I'll deal with you when I get there. Okay, so from here to here.
I think this is fine, right? See her gray hair. How pretty. Do you have wisdom in your head? Please leave a thumbs up for me. Please thumbs up the video. Just to encourage me. Thank you. We are almost done. We are almost done. So, this line has one and half. So, let's just do this. At this point, I am no more measuring the length of the, the length again. Oh. Sometimes, if a sabi is to backfire, if you want to be absolutely sure, then you should continue checking to make sure the length is equal I get eh, but I'm picking. Eh, eh, you look like a mama picking. See, as your body, the pokemon picking. You be like, say, you go sabi, the thing. <coughs> oh, my God. <coughs> Sorry, excuse me. I didn't Yes, so. What happened? Show the dog, no. Show. It's showing. You have to run and pass. Somebody wants to run across naked. Naked. I cannot wait to be done. So let's just go. I cannot wait to be done. Is it dainty? Is it dainty? Is it dainty? Ah, it is dainty enough. So let's go. This was supposed to be my Sunday life. And instead of putting it on listed, I went to put it public. And now I won't have any video for Sunday. I don't know what to do. Dun, 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 dun. Oh. I don't bend that move. I don't bend that move. I don't bend that move. Yes, he may not. And I have leak shine and jam. Move. What's the point of wasting all this time and now we're making it imperfect? Eh? You have to be perfect, baby. You have to be perfect, baby. I think I break the best when my nails are short like this. When I have nails, eh? The cornrow will just be misyanning. <laughs> Please, have you left a thumbs up? Thank you. Please leave a thumbs up. Thank you. Please leave a thumbs up. Thank you. 
A thumbs down if you don't like the video. <coughs> so sometime soon, I am going to. I actually already have it. I have my membership turned on, but I haven't really said anything about it before. In case you are interested in being supportive. I just want to let you know that it's there. So as you can see, here is going to give us the complete half of this and the complete half of this. This looks like a scissors. Looks like a scissors. <laughs> We're almost done. Last two halves. Two halves. 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 Okay, this is one. Where's the second one? Where's the second one? No. <clears throat> Let's focus on making this thing too. I really want to finish this before one hour. We have six more minutes, so let me try. Sad the flat one flower for, for one hour. Don't let it pass, baby. Don't let it pass. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Don't let it pass. Stop turning your head. Oh. This is what I do with some of my clients when they are sleeping. You have to use your body and support the head. Just the way this one's head is turning this way. Some people when they are sleeping, their head will be. So I'll just move a little bit closer. And use my body as a standing pillow. That's because most of my clients are like my friends also. You know? And you don't want your friend to be uncomfortable. So if they want to sleep, it's okay, sleep. I'll just try and still breathe while you're comfortable. Give the last flower her petal, and we are done, and we are done, and we are done, and I can go, and we are done. This life video that I, I, I go and public to do itself. Can do do some be that. Hey hey hey, ugly Tobia. That is ugly. Ugly, ugly. You have to make it dainty. This place has to. Can you see the, like? For me, it's ugly, right? But if I make this place dainty like this, then this place is going to look slender and nice. <clears throat> so, I have to take off some things here and make it go like this, and it's, it already looks better this way. You see? This is, this is the difference between this. Can you see? The flower, it's just giving a different type of flower. Not as if it's ugly, but it's it's with the type of flower we want to breathe on someone's hair. This one is more like it. It has to be dainty and pretty. I 
I'll be able to draw broccoli on your hair. Broccoli. Is so good? Is that it? Is it giving what it is supposed to give? I think it is. So let's just make it clean. I need this hair to add in. I just feel ridiculous doing this. When I stop and look at myself, it feels. I feel like if it was someone else doing it, I would laugh the person to die. But this is how it makes me happy when I have it. Can you see this tiny place that's annoying me? Come on. No root. <clears throat> this can never happen on a human being's head. Every strand of hair has its direction. On this mannequin, despite the fact that it is among the best I have used, all the hair from the roots can just be very... Oh, my neck. Half a half a half a. Baby, half a half a. We are, we are progressing. Don't worry. We'll soon be done. And some beautiful people stayed almost through the video. God bless you. How are we there? <gasps> Look at that. That looks better. This looks better. I said I wanted to finish before one, and now I have just 40 seconds left. It was even 39 seconds. Ugh! Brady, like that. We're almost done. Brady, 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 so that this video will be one hour. Not 51, not 51 minutes. Not 61 minutes, sorry. Not one hour, one minute. You know, go past 60 minutes. This video will not pass 60 minutes. This video will not pass 60 minutes. This video will not pass 60 minutes. If you have any requests, let me know in the comment section. This thing wants to make me lose it so that I am going to not keep to my time. Because this baby is just busy turning her head. <laughs> oh, baby. In the middle of the night to wake up We have the I don't know where I can see those tiny rubber bands so So there we go Can you see she doesn't want to bend her head okay Okay there you go So This is the flower. I need to make this place as tight as possible. But I don't have rubber band. That is a problem. So I'm going to use whatever I have. Let's see. have these bigger bands I'm going to use it I'm just trying to make it as tight as I can oh <laughs> look at this flower it looks so pretty oh anyway I'll just cut you off when it's time to take you down look at that 
looking for the stamp information. Stamp information, give face your front. Everybody, face your front. Everybody, face your front. Everybody. So the little girls here, I like how they used to be excited when you make pretty hair. Even the ones that are professional criers, when they are done with their hair, you can do whatever you like with this. You can make it long braid, or make several braids and add beads. But for this tutorial, I'm just going to make it into a bun. But first, I want it to be like a tiny bun, so that it doesn't interfere or close the flower. But In order to make it small, I have to braid it first. So I want the bone to start from like here and wrap down to cover the rubber band. That's too high. You know how when you're making those standing bone, what do they call it? Those bone that is like straight up. You would think that you should start from up and start creating that thing, but no. As you wrap from the bottom, it pushes it to the top. Ah, I need rubber band to hold this thing. So I don't have. So. We are done. Look at how dainty and pretty she is. Look at this. This is so nice. Thank you so much for watching. I think I'm going to stop here and I can go and admire my flower. Just imagine you made this for your daughter so and every time you see her you'll be so proud of yourself. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I think I'll stop here. Bye.